Steve has a catfish barber. Chelsea, um, yeah, I think I'm still having them as dead. I'm tipping them to be the team that falls off the most, but um, I'm, not, I'm not thinking about it too much. Any results at the start of the season, it's still early to call. Well, uh, it was beautiful to see Burnley score three. Yeah, just... man, that's crazy. What's happening on Charlottesville? <laughs> oh, you've been at a festival, so you haven't seen what's happening? No. So basically, there's, a, there's just a bunch of people in Charlottesville in America just saying that uh, White Lives Matter. Uh, so all and, the fans uh, left to go there and support the cause. Basically, they, they really hired out torches. They went to B&Q, got their torches, garden torches, lit them. and uh, They were yeah. out here supporting the cause. Supporting the cause, bro. It's all mad. That's um, where Dan is. T goes to the Chelsea fans are in mean, Charlottesville. Going ham. Let's say it, fam, Skepta was really playing there because it was not safe on the block, not even for the cops. How can the police come and say, oh, it's unsafe for us, we're going to go home? <laughs> if I phone police hey. and they ain't coming. Hey, yeah. no one's safe. Why do you think I got this mask on, cuz? My team's not racist. My team's not racist at all. Speak to Steve, oh, his team's racist. Don't worry about me, my team's just fine. We're an international brand. We have loads of Asian and African fans. Fans from all over the world, we're a big... We're a big brand. We're not racist. Yeah, they're going to play that 262 next week. And everyone will copy it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, it just seems like a disease for them. Like they win the league and the next season they're just shit. But, but 3-0 against Burnley, thank you because you took the attention away from Liverpool. And that was it 3-2? It was 3-2, but I'm just saying 3-0 because it's pretty much 3-0. Chelsea are gathering so much L's right now. Costa's in Brazil. The season started and he's in Brazil. Doing interviews with the Daily Mail. do you know how disrespectful that is? Man, they're trying to hold you hostage and you're not even there. I'll tell you what, Chelsea though, fucking 3 0 down and two goals for a man like Sam Volks. Oof. He's never going to be player of the year. I don't even think he was man of the match. Sam Volks is, that name is. The name is Butters. Fam. It's like your that forehead name. right there. Oh, allow you see the comments about your forehead? Yeah. <laughs> Sam Volks! While all this nonsense is going on with Chelsea, Diego Costa is chilling on the beach. Your club is a joke. He's been fined 300 bags. He's fine. We're fine. This is worrying times. You know what I'm seeing? I'm seeing Teth again. I reckon Chelsea probably might even fall out of top four. <sighs> They've done it before. Tottenham, Man U, Man City. Yeah, it's possible. Yeah, what we're talking about, yeah. They are. Right. I'm putting Arsenal in there. I'm no, putting I Arsenal, Arsenal in there. Might challenge. I think they're going to challenge for the league. Arsenal. No, I'm putting Arsenal, Man City, Tottenham, Man United. I'm sorry. That's my four. So, yeah, I think yeah, Chelsea possibly. Sorry, sure. mm. But Chelsea, I think Liverpool will probably fall out. Yeah, I agree, man. Chelsea aren't fit, bro. You are going to do the most running this season. Racism takes a lot out of people, man. It, it requires a lot of it's mental energy. Especially to... when you've got to catch flights to Charlotte and Beck as well. It's That's what I'm saying, rough. bro. Do you know what the maddest thing about it mm. is? Charlotte starts with a CH. Oh, Chelsea starts with a CH. Oh my gosh. Think about it, it bro. Makes That's sense. It's not a coincidence. It makes sense. Do you know what I mean? Sense. Considering yeah. you've got Diego Costa in Brazil, yeah, in some chalet, watching the game on some with some television on some flipping stool, yeah, he's doing all that. He could be there doing stuff for you, but you've outcasted him for whatever reason. I don't know what the reason is, yeah, and your team's doing that. Your team's a disgrace. Your manager wasn't wearing a suit, you know, on the sideline. It's a joke, you know what I mean? I'm just looking at your team as problems. There's a guy in Brazil, this new Murata guy, okay, he's on it. But, honestly, Dan, I'm, I'm looking at 10th. I, I, I don't even, I, you know what? I don't want to sit with you. After the, all right, cool, all right, cool. We're not going to sit together. I just find it always contradicting when ethnic minorities support Chelsea. Just something wrong, innit? It doesn't click for me. Well, I'll be honest with you. It's a bit weird, innit? I've been on a train going home from Tottenham, Arsenal, and I saw Tottenham fans saying awful stuff to Arsenal fans, just like probably Arsenal fans have been racist. I think there's racism in every club, and I think that Chelsea got highlighted, to be honest with you. So he's, this is his second show. He's not coming back. And he's got two L's. He's out there in, he's out there in Charlotte right now, beating up a bunch of black kids, like, yo, fuck you, Mitch, fuck you, Paul. I don't trust that Dan, you, innit? But he's, gonna, he's about to take three L's quickly. And this is the first, he signed his contract with, I can't wait to be on field for you, man. You know what, I do shoulders and that. Look how I went, I am. Bro, <laughs> you're about to catch another L against Spurs right, next week. that's what I'm talking about. Come man. on, tell him, yeah. Leon. Crud, but Cole's trying to save him, slip him, he's Bredson, yeah, he's light skin and all that. We don't have Bredsons at Filthy. Big man, I just said... Come Filthy, cuz. I Big... told you, you come Filthy on the group chat, you are not Savage Dan. Yeah, 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 yeah. Change that name, B. You're just Dan. You can't, do you know what? You can't get rid of Savage Dan. The Savage Dan thing is just... 
Dan, Look, put, Dan, put, Dan, put it this Dan, way, no, Savage no. Dan's nothing to do with football, and if you know what Savage Dan is, then you'll know that you can remove the name. Um, but yeah, you can't get rid of Savage Dan. Dan, can we bet? Please. What's the bet? If you lose the next game against Tottenham, you have to change the name. You can't use Dan, cuz. Yeah, it's got to go just for Dan if they if lose If you lose first. the next game, because you're a savage, innit? And savages do real things. Wait a and minute. No yeah, no, you're right, Leon, because obviously... So Matt. put the bet on. Yeah. And if you lose the Spurs, you're Dan. It's Dan. <laughs> that's a deal. That's a deal. We, no, no, that's a deal for real, bro. And Le Leon, Liam, whatever your name is. <laughs> Liam, I can't wait for you to be on this, on this couch with me because I'm just going to put you face down. I'm done with your talk. Jeremy, Jeremy, yeah. Jeremy. Jeremy Bogger. Mate, I can't. Bogger. The actor. John. John <laughs> no, no, not John. It's not John. I thought it was John. Um, but man, this geezer looks powerful. He looks like a good player, but... Come on, man, this is Chelsea. Like, you should be signing. Why did you swear this on Matic as well? He's my guy. Crazy. Isn't he, is he, in, isn't he in Star Wars or something? Jeremy Bur <laughs> Bro, that's, that's the only boy guy I know. I don't know this new guy. I'm not going to lie, fam. I don't know who the hell this guy is. A man says Jeremy Boger is in. You're talking about John Boyega? That's it. I can't John believe John Boyega. John Boyega. Hey, 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 hey Jeremy Boger. Soul destroyed for the youth. Soul destroyed. Yeah, his career's that's finished. It. He's got. What was his name again? Bogle. <laughs> Bruv, his name sounds like something out of that fucking film. What was that film called? Oh, that little Bogger. kid. Yeah, no, the one that says about the, the bog of the eternal stench. <laughs> Bogger, is it? That sounds like something that Specs eats. He just, he just mentioned seven, six, seven guys. All of those players that you just said, yeah? Baker, Dead Bogger, players. all this stuff. These are all rappers. This is what he mentioned. This, this is what he mentioned just now. All you Liverpool fans out there that have been giving United, bruv, you gave them corn, you did, but you, you, you're a nice Liverpool fan, I'll be honest. You're one of the nicer, most honest Liverpool fans, but a couple of you Scousers, a lot of you Scousers out there, you must be shitting yourself now because United are back. Romelu Lukaku. Do you know what? Let's cheers to Romelu Lukaku. I'm not even a United what fan. What a bad boy. He's a baller, he's a baller. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gassed. I am so gassed. I feel like this is the most gassed I've ever been on Fluffy Fellas. And we played one game, it's amazing. Like, you, know what? you know what is annoying? I mean, they're, they're within their rights to be gassed because when Lacazette scored against Sydney FC, Arsene Wenger said the pressure is off. So if Lukaku is getting two in the first game in the Prem against West Ham, they're entitled to get gassed. Because, what? Yeah. Wait, West Ham? Sydney FC. <laughs> West Ham? Sydney FC. <laughs> OK, maybe that's a valid point still. Scribs, Scribs thinks Lukaku's his uncle, bro. Like, and this has only been for the last couple of weeks. Before, when Lukaku was at Everton, it was just Lukaku, innit? Just a big bro. But now, Scribs wants to champion him. We'll see. Because he's going to miss sitters. He's going to miss absolute sitters, and we'll see if he's your uncle then. Yeah, I mean, you, Lukaku's overrated for me, man. Go back to Congo. I mean, they're going to challenge this year, yes. 100%. They're going to challenge. Bruv, they're a solid fucking side, and they play solid football. It's that Mourinho football. Remember that time when he was in Chelsea, they used to win everything 1-0 yep, and win yep, the league? Yep, yep, Duff, yep. what's his name, Crespo, Robin. Robin. They used to win 1-0 and they won the league. And I don't, I don't and mind I mean, that. They battered West Ham 4-0, don't, don't get me wrong. But I'm saying they play kind of like predictable almost football. Yes. But it's quality players. Everyone's on to Spurs about not signing players mm -hmm. and we just look like we picked up where we left off. West Ham signed four new players and they're experienced players, bro. Couple and ballers in there. And they're players, I'm they're not going to They're ballers. Like, they basically took Stoke's best player, arguably. And then they got Zabaleta, experienced right back. And, and then they got, So I'm saying, and obviously Hart's kind of passed it. But still, bro, he's got Hart. This is what I'm saying. And then they've let him four goals, bro. I can't. But Pogba was on job. Bro, who oh. are they playing? I know, but you can only beat what's in front of you, you know? Yeah. yeah but who are they? Look, 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 for one, you'd have to get on some stilts to, to, to get to anyone's so level. So you're to say, technically, it's not on site because they can't see each other? No. Wow. It's never going to be on site because he hides. Man comes to London, don't even tell the filthy fellas, bro. You're bottom of the league and that gap's going to widen, cuz. Hey. I'm, that gap's going to widen, cuz. I'm telling you that from now, cuz. You know what I mean? Does he? Someone's got him on site. You know what I mean? He, someone's got him in his sight. You know them ones there? So, yeah, fuck Leon. Yeah, fuck Leon Knight. Um, fuck anybody that's got anything bad to say about West Ham. Well, Steve-O, I don't know how he survived on Filthy Fellas with this team. Fucking hell, drummed 4-0. First day. Fuck. Bro, I would have resigned.
if we if we play like that, then we'll 100 million percent be in a relegation battle. But I can't see Slav having another season of his players. He won't have it. No, but why is Pogba jumping on Lukaku's back to celebrate? Because they're gas. They're like no, best mates. Cards. What's with the piggy backs? They're grown men. I know, I know, but they're, no, they're young. Fam. Come on, man. They're, they're How young? young? Man. Like one. We know Lukaku's older than he is. Oh, come on, man. He's a reborn. No, he, he, he looks young. He looks young. He doesn't look like the rest of them, man. Does Storms he look young? Because he looks like Storms. Storms looks older than Lukaku. <laughs> he does. It's the gold tooth as well. Yeah, 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 that adds like ten years. Alright, it's Pogba a baller. Pogba. I've always liked Pogba. Yeah. Pogba's a baller. Yeah. Lee. Yeah. Baller. Is Martial a baller? Yeah, hard. Martial's cold. Martial Lee? <sighs> they know you know, cuz. <laughs> oh, man. I, I think Man United are good anyway. I genuinely think they're very, very good. You let a man from Cameroon go to Italy to get his paperwork, get the nationality, and come sleep on Matip. I love him. This is a joke. How does one come on the show after being away for so long? And we're still shit. Do you understand that every season I've been on here, we've been the shittest pretty much, apart from last season when I just stopped fucking coming because it was just like, I can't carry on talking about Liverpool being average. Can I ask you, Moreno, Easy. is there a good player in him? No! I'm not going to lie, I was there, yeah. And when you look at Okaka, yeah, he just looks like the most untechiest individual I've ever seen in my life. Messi. But he was doing bits. He was doing bits, bro. I was right next to Klopp and Klopp was losing his head scrims. Yeah. Bro, I saw like, Four massive veins bulging out of his neck. He stuck it on Hendo like five times and sweared at him. Yo, Liverpool haven't really, really wanted this title since John Barnes, fam. They might as well just allow it, fam. Less fruit, more Salah. That's a good signing. But this Dominic Solanke, you. Solanke, man, is so lanky. Come like me. Uh, but always do these weird, dodgy signings, man. Like Babel and all that. Why would you say Ryan Babel. Oh, wow. You brought it back, Leon. Liverpool, a joke. The last time I saw Vuj was about seven months ago. <laughs> so that says it all. I saw Snips the other day in the club. We just walked straight past each other. <laughs> so yeah, Lippo, I don't want to hear it no more. It's over, man. You know what? The maddest Dead. thing of Simeone was the third goal. No one even spoke about it, but cool. The guy smashed it in from close range. But he's directed a ball back into the That was terrible, bro. And when you look at it, no one's talking about it, but the ball was going nowhere. And Mignolet has directed it with his hand towards the goal. So not away from the goal. He's, I know it's a reflex. But nah. you're a keeper, pat it away. Keepers, or, are, that's what they're trained for, bro. Or like box it, like hit it away from the goal. But a man went bang. They have the Wenger complex with Mignolet. What's, the, what's, what's, the, what's, what, what is the Wenger complex? Like you that's start wrong. the season, yeah. gassed. Yeah. And then by the time reality kicks in, mm. it's too late to make any changes. Okay. Then by the time the season finishes and you can make the changes, you get gassed again. Ah. So it's like a cycle of it's fuckery. A vicious, it's a vicious cycle. Yeah. Did you see him knock the ball behind him? Bro, Towards the goal. He's the worst goalkeeper in the Prem, fam. Who's that? Min Who's that? Mignolet. Mignolet, bro. What a butter... Simon. Like, Liverpool, what is that dodgy keeper's cast? Yeah, Bruce... What is it? Bruce, Bruce Grubbler? Yeah, they're all dodgy cast. You can't keep buying fringe players. This is in Dortmund. This is the Prem. Yeah. You're not going to play 1875 Munchen next week. Hmm. You've got fucking Brighton and Hove Albion. You've got Stoke City away. There ain't no fucking Monchka Gladbachs here. Everybody's got a lion in their fucking crest. This is the Prem.